Brawl! He was chief amongst nightmares, prowling the endless corridors in innumerable rooms, stalking helpless souls. It's not a laughing matter, you see. He takes his job very seriously. <laughs> but I can laugh. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, behold, a cloud. Does he make you laugh? No, I find him quite amusing in his own special way. Look at his meager stature, his plain and dull face. Listen to his weak, trembling voice as he's trying in vain to entertain you. But entertain you he will, as he is nature's greatest joke. What is he up to now? He can move, you know. That's a good boy. Ooh, you made him angry now. Look how he pouts while roaming about. Think. Yes, definitely. He's trying to... Well, he's trying to kick those pipes, but... Oh, I get it. He wants to repair the toy maker's pipe system. A bomb dispenser? Who put that there? Do you think he can do something with it? I don't know, like kick the bomb into my minions. Oh, the irony! If only I cared for those wretched souls trapped in the lifeless husks. I don't, if you're still wondering. I don't think he has it in him. Oh, you disagree? Maybe a gentlemanly bet then. I win, you bring me a puppy. Why? I need him for a social experiment. If I lose, well, let's not get ahead of ourselves, shall we? What do you know? He made it. No puppies for me, I guess.
the plot thickens. It seems he actually tries to achieve something. Those pipes, there's chemicals in them. I know because I'm the one who put them there. Nothing you should concern yourself with. This will become boring fast. Let's make it more interesting. Send the minions in. They'll make short work of him. Where does he hold all those bombs? I don't know. Probably got something to do with the quantum mechanics of a clown car. He's getting something done. Haven't seen him so worked up since... Hmm, now that you mention it, I haven't seen him worked up at all. He's rather the sulk in the corner type. This is new to both of us. Let's savor the moment. He's trying to make a concoction of sorts, I think. But he hasn't a glimmer of a spark of a ray of ingenuity in him. Excellent! With our help, he created a confusion gas. And strangely, strangely lost in thought. Confusion. 
had set in. It wasn't always this way, was it? Surely not. Surely he was once a great, renowned clown. Oh, he wasn't. He couldn't make people laugh, no matter how hard he tried. Shame, really. He drifted from circus to circus until depression finally drove him to the Emporium. Touching story, really. Hit all the right heartstrings. Too bad we won't see it through to the end. If inhaled in large quantities, the gas is quite deadly. It's the secret ingredient X doing its job. Shh, just don't tell anyone. Anyway, I don't think he has the will or the wit to escape this one. God bless you. Whoa there, cowboy. Wrong turn. God bless you. Whoa there, cowboy. What doesn't kill you makes you stronger, I guess. Or weirder, in your case.
The gloves are off. No more Mr... Ah, uh, who am I kidding? I wasn't that nice to begin with. Let me see. Who can I... Ah, uh, yes. The wrestler. The she-giant. She'll make quick work of this unfunny little man. Here's some reinforcements. Obviously not for you, clown. I never said I played fair. <laughs> The key, as always, is not to die. Here's some reinforcements. Obviously not for you, clown. Here's some reinforcements. Obviously not for you, clown.
By the way, you've got an ultimate too. I never said I played fair. <laughs> In retrospect, maybe sending a CQC combatant against a clown that can kick bombs and confuse you wasn't my best idea. You live and you learn, as they say. We'll be missing you, wrestler. As for you, clown, I'm done with your... Mm, clowning.